has it changed? Y yes, it, it's uh, it has changed. No, I don't think so. <laughs> it's been uh, it's been a struggle. I'm not gonna lie. I think it's definitely changed. Everywhere has changed. It's great. I think it's coming back. I'm from Wales. Zambia. In the the United, United Kingdom. Thailand. Guam. New Zealand. United Kingdom, Jersey, Channel Island. London, baby. The UK. We're, I'm leaving tomorrow. But it's been a fantastic five days. We've done the tram, we've done uh, a variety of different uh, activities. Uh, very, very nice restaurants. Zuma, I would recommend. Right, very quiet right now, not as uh, lively yet. But on the coming up again. This is the first time back in three years. It's it's not quite the vibrant uh, city that it was, or yeah, but uh, it's still a lovely place. I hiking. love the hiking. Yeah, the views hiking. are amazing in Hong Kong. Nice, and definitely yeah. going to Langtao Island. Oh, yes. Very cool. That's Very cool. super yeah. nice. Yeah. Try um, local food. Yes, yeah. it's amazing. And like, try to interact with the local people also. Like, they might look scary, but when you when you actually try to communicate. They're friendly, the yeah. most friendly people. Uh, this is my third time in Hong Kong. Maybe less traveler, but I don't think another thing is different, you know? It's still convenient in so many ways. Like it's been a tough, tough couple of years, but I feel like having got past it, um, it's so nice to see Hong Kong open again, you know? And people having a good time, enjoying themselves, getting dressed up. I mean, I'm Superman and it's been tough for me, um, but it's nice to be finally out there, meeting the public, saving lives, that sort of thing. The best place in Hong Kong is Hampton. Have you been to Hampton? It's the best beach in Hong Kong and nobody knows about Hampton. I, I love Hong Kong and I'm, gl I'm glad that Hong Kong is back to normal and we can just go out and enjoy things. Come here, I would recommend the uh, Aqualuna. The Aqualuna is the most beautiful ride ever. The Aqualuna is what my my parents respected the most. Oh, we went Eat to the a lot peak. of good food. Went to the peak. peak. Yeah. Wonton noodle soups. Wonton oh noodle. yeah, we had wonton noodle soup this morning. Amazing. Do you think Hong Kong has changed a lot? No, it's the best place ever. It's my oh, like, third time here. I think this is the most Hong Kong has had foreigners since the COVID situation. Honestly, it feels good. I like it. We're going to be on boats, we're going to go up to Mong Kok, we'll go to Central. We're just going to go to the Sevens and then we're also going to look around the city, a little bit sightseeing. Yeah. A little bit of countryside, everything. We want to go to Sai Kung, is that how you call it? The, yeah, the, the beaches. Camping, camping place. Or I have the beaches. There seems to be a lot of renewal. Um, it's still, a lot of shops are closed because of COVID. It seems to have been COVID affected. Um, but apart from that, it's pretty much the same. A bit more expensive. We went to the Big Buddha. But that was a bit too foggy for us, the Big Buddha. Yeah, but it was nice. It was worth going up. And the, eh? and the, the other one was the peak. Yeah, we really enjoyed that. We're here for what's called a bachelor party or a stag do in the UK. It's one of our friends getting married. So obviously it's, it's a tradition Total three days. come away for a few days, yeah. Today was a good experience and we've got a boat that's going to take us around the Hong Kong harbour tomorrow where we've got a few games and we're going to sit, have some food, have some drinks and sail around the uh, Hong Kong house. Have some fun. Great. We love Hong Kong. Uh, I really like the local food. Like, it's so nice to, to like, try a different kind of food because in Europe, it's not like, there's not a big variety of Asian food. So yeah, that's so far. I really enjoy the weather. Even though it's a little bit cloudy, it's still way warmer than Germany. Yeah, I do think it's changed quite a bit. Not too, too much, but a little bit with the whole um, pandemic. Um, there's a lot more masks around, I'm not going to lie, there's a lot more masks. Yeah. Um, but other than that, I think it's still an amazing city. I love it very much. Yeah, we love Hong Kong. Yeah, it's great. No, I don't think so, not since the other two times I've been here. We're getting back to normal. It's really good. Hong Kong is becoming alive again, which is fantastic. It's amazing. Everything is opening up. Uh, there's a big culture here. Yeah, which, which, is, which is amazing. The people here are very friendly, actually, yeah. which we thought like wouldn't happen because you're from another country. But they're very friendly, very good, very homecoming here. So like, like we've been loving it, to be fair. Uh, we're supposed to be here for a year, but it can't be longer because we love it here, actually. So it's Actually, we came here for six months, but we think we'll stay here for much for longer. Much longer, yeah. Uh, Hong Kong's awesome. <laughs> Yeah. Yes, yes, we've seen lots of diff different people from around the world. It's really nice to see. Yeah, very nice. And very clean as well. Very, very clean, clean, yeah. Clean. Love that. Everybody very nice. Yes, friendly. I'd say, yeah, I mean, taking this into account, yeah. You've got people all over the world coming to Hong Kong and, um, yeah, absolutely.
for us, for us as well, I think, coming from the UK, living in China, coming to Hong Kong, it's, it's like a home away from home. It's great. I think it's coming back and all the tourists are coming back and the economy is coming. It's really nice. It's, it's super great. Like for January, everything's open. It's really great. It's really amazing for partying and for 70s. Oh, yes. I'm very international. Always world welcome. Everyone treats me well. The minute I land, you know, and I always feel safe here. I must say, it's very important. I think it's definitely changed. Um, I think it's a lot cleaner now. People are more mindful about their surroundings and just to be more environmentally clean. So yeah, definitely. And I still think it's an international country. There's a lot of tourists come and yeah, it's really great. I love it still. People from everywhere. It's a hub. It's a melting pot. It's where anything is possible. I think it's international because they have so much opportunities here that is not, that is different from the mainland. And I think that's what makes it more international. For example, just the the size of this this uh, rugby event right now. It's amazing. Incredible. It's so nice. Love the best that. city in the world. Beautiful, beautiful like country. Anywhere else in the world. Singapore, Dubai, Singapore. Hong Kong. <laughs>